project. Back here at the land, it's uh, 19 degrees today. It's going to be a top of 23, so it's going to be a beautiful day. There's a nice breeze just coming up through the valley there. And uh, yeah, today's going to be a great day to get some jobs done. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to carry on with the uh, putting the posts in and setting those posts. So uh, let's get changed into some work gear and let's get started. So the idea now is that okay, I've actually got, you know, both of those are, are level, they're level within a couple of millimetres and that's that's accurate enough. So both of those pieces of wood are level, I'm going to run the chainsaw along those pieces of wood and use them as a guide and that should then get that top face nice and flat and at the same height as the, uh, the breeze block over there. That's the plan, let's get the chainsaw onto this now and see how we go. So that's uh, the build. You just say it went through, uh, went through quite easily there. Right, let's uh, let's carry on and get uh, get the rest of them done. I've been progressing my way through these. So that's the second one. The third one, when I came to it, I realised I was just too short to get a get a good clean cut. So what I did is I took took an extra depth off there, the depth of a breeze block, so that'll have that sat on top of it. So number four is just completed. I'm just going to start on the fifth one now. Right, we'll get that one cut now. And uh, that'll be this complete full front row. Completely uh, all level, all in the same plane and all level. So, uh, and then start marking out the holes for or the positions for the next row of holes. And that's the last one cut. And, uh, luckily, a little bit of a div in the middle there, but um, apart from that, the rest of it I've checked it with a uh, spirit level and it's perfectly flat, and perfectly level. So, if we look down there now. you can see with this camera. Okay, so let's uh, let's now start marking out, working out and marking out the position of these holes. You see the ones at that end there, the, uh, the posts are going to be quite long. I think the important bit now is 
get the holes drilled and then I'll work out what, what length post I need. What I think I might do to ensure that the, the holes that I put in are actually square to the square to the center line of these, I might actually bring over one of the steel frames and from over there and basically just rest it rest it on these um, rest it on these posts, lift it up so that it's it's horizontal, and then I'll mark where the corner is with a with a plumb bomb. And um, that'll give me the exact centre of the hole over there. Do the same thing for this hole, and then do a string line between them and, uh, and spray paint where the uh, where the holes need to go. Because I know that that frame there is yeah, is perfectly square. So to set that set that at home with, a, with an engineer square. So I think I'll do that. I'll bring those frames over, and we'll uh, we'll have a go at setting it. And once I'd marked all the centre lines, it was time to get the 600mm diameter auger out and drill some holes. With all of the holes augered, it was time to put the log grab back on, get back into the wood pile and pull some big logs out that will be used as stumps. Once I pulled these into the processing area, we got the 462 onto them and cut them down to length.
of those five posts, the second row, I've got all of those five posts set. So today I've augured the holes and cut the posts and then set the posts in position. So next time I come back the job will be to uh, yeah, cut them off at the right length. As you can see they're all standing a lot higher than they need to be at the moment. But um, now I'm pretty happy with the progress today. So I think I'm going to call it a day now. It's uh, almost six o'clock. It's been a warm, warm day today. I'm glad there's a bit of a breeze now in the trees. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful day today. breeze is just helping to cool things down a bit otherwise it was a very uh, very hot and sticky dusty day okay so tune in next time and we'll see me cut the tops of those off get them all level and then start to uh, start to drop the steel frame in place and then hopefully things will uh, progress really quickly after that because it should be quite a quick process to assemble it all okay tune in next time